Hey guys, so I wanted to come to you a lot sooner this morning. It is 20 past 11. So I've been up since the crack of dawn. I've just been cleaning, just general things and stuff like that. So I've done all of my windows, got rid of all like the mildew and crap stuff that happens in the winter. It's surprising how actually dirty the actual glass of the windows gets as well. So that's all done. All the washing's put away. There's a wash ready to come out to be dry, so I'll put another wash on. And I've actually cleaned the glass of the windows as well. So that's all good in the hood. Um, I've just had my hair cut. So I messaged my neighbour, I was in the bath yesterday, I was like, oh, I could do with a haircut. Maybe I'll get it cut for my birthday. So I messaged my neighbour and I was like, oh, okay, is there any chance I could have my hair cut soonish? And she was like, yeah, 11 o'clock tomorrow. And I was like, perfect, I'm actually free. So. Yeah, that's my hair. I've had quite a lot chopped off. So I've just gone for like a box cut again. It probably was like down to here before. Um, I do have a before and after photo, which I'll put up on Instagram. So I'll leave my Instagram name so you can see the difference. But this is all of my hair. Oh, but it's all, it's just so yuck and dead and I just wanted to get it off. So I've had, a little bit of a fringe chopped in as well, just to sort of shorten that. So these bits here, these short bits here are the fried frazzled broken bits. So we are nearly there. They've only got to grow like that much. Obviously this part's gonna grow longer as well. So maybe when my hair gets to like here, I don't know, I might have it chopped again to incorporate this, like chop this part of my hair off, obviously when it's longer. And then that will be all the dead stuff gone then. So actually I think it's all gone now. She has chopped some of the fried bits off, but yeah. How cool is that? I love it. I think it's really, really nice. Cause it's still, I still look like me when I go like this, but it's just a little bit shorter. It's the shortest I've had my hair in a fricking long time. So love, 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 love. Thank you, Shirley. Love. Hey guys. So what's the time now? It's 25 past five in the afternoon. I haven't really done a lot today. Um, I've had like a bit of a chill out day. Um, I've edited a few videos, um, but primarily been trying to work out why some of my videos that I filmed in January have already gone to my iCloud and it's been a bit of a ball ache really to get them from my iCloud back onto my phone. Um, my phone keeps staying, it hasn't got enough storage, even though I'm like deleting things that I would say a sufficient amount of things to regain the storage it needs, but... Either way, it just wasn't playing ball. So that's taken a lot of time. I had some lunch. Um, what did I have? I had a massive salad um, just with some slices of ham because tonight I'm going out for the all-you-can-eat buffet. So that's what I'm going to be doing now. I'm going to be taking the makeup that I've got on, off, and reapplying some different makeup. And I need to figure out what I'm wearing because I still don't really know. Um... But yeah, so I'll catch up with you once I am done. Hey guys, so it's quarter past uh, seven now, so I really do need to get shifty on, but I just wanted to show you my makeup. I've done a lot of like a darker eye look, um, purple blush, which looks ridiculous in this lighting, and a really dark lippy. Um, and I'm just gonna switch the camera around to give you an outfit of the evening. So tonight I've gone for this like maroony colored blouse along with my leather skirt that's got sort of like rose embossing on it and then I thought I'd always wear just plain black tights so I thought I'd go for these tights that have got some sort of like rose petally detailing on them. Um, my bitch boots and just this uh, locket, is that what they're called? A locket there. Um, and then I've also got on some black rose earrings to tie in with the black roses on the tights and on the leather skirt. So this is the bag of choice for the evening. 
It's the most grungiest black bag. I don't know whether to take that or my black Kate Spade one. I just don't know. But I'm going to be wearing my uh, leopard print jacket. And I really do have to go. So hopefully I can vlog a little bit later. But we'll see what's what. I'll just have to go with the flow. But yeah. Ta -da! I look like a different person with this hair, right? I don't know. Maybe it's just me. When I look in the mirror, I'm like, who's that? Oh, yeah, it's me. <laughs> Lol. Anyway, I shall see y'all later. Hey guys, so I'm just in my car waiting for my work's colleagues to arrive. Um, the bizarrest thing just happened as I was driving through town. Like I got into the town centre and it was like pitch black, all like the street lights had gone out, all the traffic lights had gone out, all the shop lights, all the shops were shut with the shutters down and like I had to drive past the restaurant that we were going to to get here and like the lights were off, there were people coming out and um, like the next restaurant along there's a dessert restaurant called Casper's and that was closed and I was just like what's going on and like there were people everywhere there were cars go trying to get everywhere so the traffic lights weren't working there were the blimmin police everywhere sirens going off police cars running here there and everywhere and I was just like what is happening like I know Trump has just become president but that does not mean that the world has got to fall to pieces instantly <laughs> like I, I was just like what's going on it was almost like like out of a film kind of thing I was just like bloody hell so I went what the hell was that so I went round and parked, uh, tried to park behind, but it was completely full. So trying to get out of that was a bloody nightmare. So I went round the block and passed the restaurant again. And as if by magic, all the lights had come on. And so suddenly there were like customers in, in the restaurants and stuff. And I was just like, was I just dreaming? Did I just make that up? <laughs> like I called, I called my manager and no, my assistant manager. And I was like, I think the restaurant's shut. There's no lights on or anything. I was just like, what? And then when I drove past, it was like as if nothing had ever happened. I was like, what? <laughs> so strange. So I was like, oh God. <laughs> so now I'm just sitting in Sainsbury's and I've sort of parked in a position where they have to drive past me so I know if they're here or not. So yeah, it's a little bit mental. Crazy stuff. Anyway, I'm sure it will all be fine when we get there. But the table's booked for seven minutes time um, and I can't actually see us getting there in seven minutes time so it probably takes about seven minutes to walk from this particular car park up to where we need to be so y'alls anyway I shall speak to you all later bye